way I get jobs is I ask the director, can I be in the movie? I didn't know there were so many insane people in the room. So that's why you were doing that? Yeah, that's ah. it. Cool. No one has a pink one, do they? Oh, steady on, there's a riot. Look at it. Look at it, it's like I'm feeding ducks. OK, <laughs> it went straight over my head. <laughs> <laughs> And welcome to the start of the Saga Celebrity Talk Show. And it's, a, it's a rather sad day because this is the last talk show. Oh. Oh. My wife's cheering down here. <laughs> now, it's great to have you all here. Hey. Oh. Yoo-hoo. My words. Hello there. Hello. Warwick. Yes? Uh, who's that? It's me, Ben. Ben? Now, hang on a minute, hang on. How can I be sure it's really you? I need to see some form of identification. You don't need to see my identification. I don't need to see his identification. <laughs> come here, my little friend. Well, come where? I, I can't even see you. You're a feisty little one. Mm, thank you. <laughs> I can't believe this. Ladies and gentlemen, we have Obi-Wan Kenobi here with us. <laughs> so, mate, I know. Ah, now that's a name I've not heard in a long time. Yes, well, what are you doing here? Well, to tell you the truth, I've been at a bit of a loose end since the end of episode six. Oh, right. Luke doesn't need an old fool like me anymore. So I thought I'd come to the world they call Disney and guide you in the ways of the talk show. Oh, well, that's very nice of you, Ben, but, um, you know, I'm all set for guidance. Uh, I've got a great production team here at Disney MGM Studios and uh, they're doing... Warwick, the yes, you yes. must finish your training. The dark side is powerful, easier, more seductive. Oh, yes. Don't take the path that Jerry Springer did. He was once a pupil of mine. All right, well, thank you very much, Ben. I will certainly bear that in mind, sir. Thank I'm you, sir. I'm here if you need me. Super. Thank you. Wow. Don't well, hesitate to call. No, I won't. Thank you very much, Ben. Well, Ben Kenobi's here with us, ladies and gentlemen. We are blessed. We are blessed. <laughs> now, uh, as you, sorry, just excuse me a moment here. I just, uh, just noticed an item over on the table here. Anybody know what these are? These are my bolus from Return of the Jedi. Smashing. I haven't... Uh, I haven't seen these in years. Does anybody remember what I did with these? There's a bit of swinging around the, around the head. Actually, that doesn't feel quite right. I sort of need a log or something. Perhaps the, uh, the sofa here could, could double as a log for this. Check this out. Recreating the moment, ladies and gentlemen, live here in the ABC Theatre. Right, let's... Uh, photo moment coming up, folks. Let's, let's get this here. Check that. I can still do it. Oh, yeah. After all these years. I think the crash was a little over the top. <laughs> Only that far down. <clears throat> I want to go back Be to... Be nice to me. Oh, of course I will. You know me oh, now. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> you're a producer. Oh, no. OK, you're a producer. <laughs> People think that you sit all day in a plush office, smoking a big cigar, counting your money and, and getting your assistant to make calls for you. I know that's not true. So I've set this little scenario up so we can see what you really do. Right? <laughs> There's your budget. Beautiful. There's your big cigar. Enjoy. And there is your mobile phone. OK? So you're all set there. You're in your office. If anyone's from the UK, he looks a bit like Del Boy and only pulls the horses. Yeah. Um, <laughs> so, now, Rick, I know there is a rumour rolling around, pardon the pun, that uh, you're going to be working on a fourth Indiana Jones movie fairly soon. We're not going to go into that now. But you need look no further than this very stage for your replacement for Harrison Ford. No, it's not Peter Mayhew. Okay. It's in fact yours truly. What an interesting, bold idea. Let me help you. <laughs> <laughs> Let me help you envisage this more accurately as I go down here. Do you excuse me? <laughs> There's no stairs here, really. Excuse me. <laughs> okay. I'm coming back up. Yeah. Oh, I caught my chin then. Uh, I might be able to say a few of these too. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, I'm not cheap. <laughs> Rick, um, 
just in case you're not convinced already, but I don't know how you can't be, um, <laughs> my technical team here at MGM Studios have apparently created me a reel. And this will show me as the, the Indiana Jones of the future. I've never seen this, folks, so I'm very excited to see this. <laughs> oh, it's a good start. He's tall. I'm sure, even for an element. He is handsome. Yeah, that's not so good. He fears nothing. <laughs> oh, no, that's not right either. <laughs> He's skilled with weapons. Oh, come on. He's a competent horseman. Oh, that's embarrassing. And he knows how to handle a whip. Oh. He's good with the ladies. Cut it out! <laughs> and the men. Oh, no. Oh, come on. He's a nifty little... No, 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 no. Oh. Rick, that's just embarrassing, guys. Come on. What are you doing to me? I make all this effort and... Oh, hang on, Rick. Just a minute. I want to prove to you I can do action. Okay? Are you ready back there? Action! Here it comes. Okay, I'm ready. Here it comes. Come on. Come on. Now, Rick, I also, in doing my research, understand you used to be a stuntman yourself. So oh, no. don the famous hat and come with oh, me. Jesus. Okay? Dear God, please. You'll never see this anywhere else, folks. You Join me out here. Me. Come on, Rick. Come on, let's, let's do this. So I'll put your hat on there. Okay? <laughs> hey? Indiana McCallum. So face that way, you better, because this is coming after you, man. Okay? You tell me action, you cue this, and I'm rolling this boulder after you. Okay. You, you cue me. Go for it. Action, here we go. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Very good, oh. fantastic. Ladies and gentlemen, Rick McCallum, fantastic. Thank you.